beer. He's drinking the beer? Oh my yeah. god. This Large moth. Proboscis. This moth is No, a drunk. don't touch it, Dad. Oh my, it look at, oh my, I didn't even notice the colors on that. It's nice it's on the cans for size of reference. Yes, I know, look at my hand. Oh no, it's like not a good reference. <laughs> the can's a good reference. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Hey everyone, I just wanted to do um, an update video. What have I been doing lately? Lots of family things. I've had family non-stop. Lots of activities this summer. For me personally, with my family. Uh, last month, kind of crazy because it was my grandmother's 90th birthday. So we had a really big surprise party for her and lots and lots and lots of family came in from out of town. So uh, as you saw in that one video I had a couple weeks ago, we went to Carlsbad Caverns, did a bunch of things with them. It was really cool because some of the family I haven't seen in a decade or more, or more even more than that. So it was really cool. Um, and then after that, like right after the last family member of them left, my aunt and uncle from Dallas came to visit and they were here for a little bit and then we know we did activities with them and then they left and then shortly after that, which was about last week, we went out of town with my husband's family. We went to Van Horn, Texas with his um, uncle. He's a rancher for some ranch, this really big ranch out in Van Horn. So his whole family kind of did a family reunion thing there and we camped out and you know it's in the middle of the wilderness you know in the desert so you know we would ride our ATVs and we'd go check out we see deer we see jackrabbits cottontails what else they had cattle on the ranch so it was a really cool really relaxed place to hang out and just be with family um, so yeah so that's what I've been doing lately as far as tutorials for this channel, I know last one I uploaded was the last part of the Selena crop jacket. Um, I have a lot of other videos that I want to do. I'm just not sure like in what order I should do them priority wise. I did score another vintage TV off Craigslist a couple weeks ago. So that's been in my garage. Although I don't know if anybody wants another dog bed tutorial. I mean, it's, it's pretty much the same idea every time you know you just get creative with the decorating part I did want to try and do that one look like all marble with the contact paper but this one's pretty banged up so I'm going to see how smooth I can get it sanded but I mean I, again if you want to see that let me know if not you know I'll just kind of do it and, and then sell it also I wanted to do another talking video um, small demonstration about needle usage like when and where how to switch why we use other needles for certain fabrics so i have that um on my mind also there are some fabric hot glue gun sticks if you didn't know that they, they do make these and i just kind of wanted to do a test maybe do like a small skirt tutorial using those hot glue sticks just because i'm curious as to what the longevity and durability of that glue like how good would it does it work like especially on garments like you're wearing it and you're putting tension on the seam so I'm just curious about that um but yeah I'm just hanging out eating a bunch of stuff getting fat again I know don't I don't know I'm like so weird I always talk about that I just family comes in it's like so hard to eat right and uh, yeah you know my struggle so there's that. Um, so yeah, oh, also another thing, my son, my oldest son just went on a vacation for 10 days with his grandparents out of town. So he did, he, we were all nervous because I didn't know how he was going to behave on his first plane ride because my son's kind of like anxious and he gets scared very easily. So it all worked out though. It was perfectly um, Yeah, so right now we're just kind of in my house spring cleaning, organizing. I got a lot, a lot of new sewing equipment in lately and my garage is just like freaking overfilling with stuff. I really need to throw out some things, sell stuff, reorganize because I, I, I came into a new sewing table cabinet and I got two new mannequins and, and I mean I already have a bunch of sewing tables in my garage so I'm just like running out of space really bad. 
and it's really upsetting my husband. So I took, you know, all this week and I'm just working on custom orders, some boxing trunks, dresses uh, for one pageant girl, one for another uh, family client of mine, a uh, blouse. Um, as far as Halloween orders, if you're interested in getting Halloween costumes from me, I usually, I mean, even if you can order it earlier than this, but I officially start taking Halloween orders August 1st and I will stop October 1st. Like I have to stop by October 1st just to catch up for that whole month. Um, if I have time during the month of October, I may open up a spot, but usually that's just local wise in case I need to have it ready like the day before Halloween. Of course, if you're local, like that's per perfectly fine if the client agrees to it. But that's what I'm doing. I'm going to figure out what tutorial type video I'm going to do next. I just need to get all this organizational stuff out of the way because my God, my studio is just a hoarder's paradise. So uh, I'll just leave some clips here of all the shenanigans I've done the past week and a half. So have a good one. Enjoy your summer, ladies and gentlemen. Okay.